Hey there, this is Mr. Mike Kaufman. In this video, I'm going to take a look at how to attribute images to the owner, meaning how to give credit to the owner of a certain image that you might use or remix in your own creative work. So if I go over to Google and I search, for example, an image of a book, click on images, and then I'm gonna head over down to the tools and I'm gonna check out usage rights. Right. I want to make sure that I'm finding an image that I'm allowed to use, right? That has been labeled for reuse, for example, or labeled for reuse modification. Right. So if I click there, Google now is saying that the images that it's showing me are labeled for reuse. Now, I do have to though take a next step in to verify that information because Google does not actually own this content, so they can't guarantee it. They just find the content for me. So it's still possible that um, there might be a mistake made. However, I have found that Google is pretty consistent in terms of getting this right. Now, how do I check and how do I then find the information to attribute or to cite or to give credit to the owner? Let's say I want this nice uh, picture of this dark gray book here. I'm gonna go over here and I'm gonna click on the link. Now, from first glance, from free stock photos biz, my gut is that it is actually an image that is labeled for reuse. Let's click on the link and find out. All right, so if I scroll down, I now have the information and I can see right off the bat, Creative Commons public domain, meaning I'm allowed to use it. Now, when I attribute or give credit to the owner, I am gonna need some of this information, right? The title, who it's by, and its license type. All right, so how would I do that? I'm gonna go over to a, a Google document so I can show you. I'm gonna put a little quotation marks illustration of book, right, of a book. Close quotations, and then I'm gonna say who it's by. And in this case, it is by Ginger Coons acquired from Ocala website. So, I'm actually gonna copy this link. By Ginger Coons, and I'm going to put the link on this person's name. I'm going to hit apply and then I'm going to do a little uh, slash right there and I'm going to go Creative Commons public domain. And I might, just to do an extra good job, link the actual image there as well. So there we go. There I have it. I now have a correct um, attribute to the owner of this image, even though it's labeled for public use by the CC public domain, I'm free to use it in the work that I create. I am going to give credit to the owner because that's the right thing to do. And I've done it successfully, again, by going over the title of it, who did it, as well as the type of um, public domain label it has. That is it. That's a quick interview. Uh, overview of how to attribute images that you find on Google Images easily and quickly. Good luck.